Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be reacting to BTS. Today we're going to be watching We Are Bulletproof Part 2 and No More Dream. This was like right after they debuted in 2013. They're going to look like children. I'm so excited. Jungkook just comes right in. I really didn't expect them to be wearing anything other than something very similar to the music video, so... Not surprised. <laughs> J-Hope in No More Dream Era owns my ass. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just saying. Look at him, oh my god. Did I almost say look at my baby? Yes, I did. You know, oh no, oh no, <laughs> it's the hair. Oh, they do the dance break. Sick. J Hope owns it. So does Jimin. I really want to see them do something like this again. Like, go back to this type of music and do all right jungkook you fucking show off <laughs> anyway if you love jungkook give this video a thumbs up when jungkook dances like a boss give this video a thumbs up <laughs> anyway i would love for them to do music like that again and do like a dance break like that again seems like it's been a while since i did something like that hobie's wearing that mask thing Remember what I said about Hobie in No More Dream Era owning my ass? Proof. I keep clapping this because I'm like... I just wish... I would never change anything about BTS. Anything. Their music throughout the years. Who they are. Who they've grown as people to be. Nothing. I love that part. Anyway, but there's one thing I would change and I would go back and I would tell damn June, honey, that hair, <laughs> no. Bring back rapper Jungkook to K-19. It's a simple request, just one song. And never let damn June bring that hair back. He can pull off anything else, but that just... I would love to hear this song live. Like, if I were to see them in concert, I would hope they would sing this. Sugar looks like a friggin' baby. Oh my god. Young in the glasses. Oh, it's a good day. <laughs> Jehovah! I love him. Listen, they're all my bias records, but I stay loyal. My bias. He's number one. Literally, I almost called him my baby like two minutes ago, so I mean, that's where we are. Oh my god, the abs. The only thing I don't like is, like, I know everybody freaks out about Jimin's abs, but it makes me sad to think about, like, the fact that he struggled with <sighs> literally that. That's the feeling. He struggled with, you know, self-image and, and then eating disorder. So like, I just, I don't know how long that went on. I don't know what years that went on, but um, iconic. But um, when I see his abs, I'm like, yeah, he looks really good, obviously. But I care about them like people. So when I see that, it's like, 
Did he starve himself or push himself too hard to get those? You know, I shouldn't think like that, but I do. I just hope he's taking care of himself better nowadays. I wish I could explain. <laughs> Nam June with that hair. No. I love BTS. Looking at them when they were babies is just like heartwarming to know that they've come so far to reach people like me who are freaking American like that's amazing they're breaking down barriers they are expanding like they are showing the world Korean music and k-pop as a whole and I just couldn't be prouder I love them so much if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more, please subscribe to my channel. And until next time, please go support BTS. Thanks. They deserve it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.